Hello. Hello. I'm Ross the Rabbit Twistedly Insane. Don't ask me how that happened. I met a woman named Brenda Brown. I thought it was a, she was a catfish. The next thing I know, I'm on this TV show. Well, it's really a Facebook show. Facebook. Anyway, here's where you go with that joke. You were breadcrumbing him, so he breadcrumbed his dick. Don't worry, you'll see her maybe in a week or two. So there's the joke or the tie in there. Maybe you did that. I missed something. I am twistedly insane. So, you know, I've been reading the Bible lately, and that book's really fucked up. Because, like, the first thing God says is, don't eat or smoke from this tree. We failed. Next, he says, don't kill. We failed. Then he tried self-circumcision. Tells Adam, yeah, circumcise yourself. Adam says, Albert Abraham says, what? He goes, and what is this going to give me? The blessing of children. So God said, don't kill them. Then God said, kill them. So Abraham takes his you know, six-year-old son. I have a six-year-old son. I know I'm old, but I have a six-year-old son. So it kind of went like this. Papa, I know we're going to sacrifice something. We have everything we need, but where's the sacrifice? Don't worry. God will provide everything we need along the way. Okay, Papa. Papa, we've been walking for two days and we still don't have a sacrifice for God. It's okay. Don't worry. God will give us what we need. So that's pretty messed up. So you circumcise yourself. You get children. What happens after that? Does anyone know the Ten Commandments? Do you know why the Jews only took ten? It was a 30-day trial and after that they charged. So we took the free ten ones. Can anyone name one of the Ten Commandments? I'll go with "Thou not steal" as a comic. Don't steal my jokes because they're not funny. So apparently there were, you know, nine other tribes we lost. One of these tribes went with the premise that if I break this commandment eight times or more in a week, I get a medal. And they just went with that. I broke commandment four eight times. I broke commandment six nine times. And I'm doing the time for it now. And then there was the Epstein clan, that every time the Jews got in trouble, someone would come out and go, who did this? And they go, Jew people. <laughs> well, do you know which way they went? They go, Jewish. <laughs> you know, I swear, our, you know, we have everything backward. I'm not even Jewish, because I took the rabbi and put a cross at the end, because wait till I get to Jesus, you're really going to fucking hate me. His name was actually, like, Yossi. The reason he got the name Jesus is because they put him on the Jew sus stick. <laughs> yeah, because that's the first weapon, is the Jew stick and the Jew rock. In fact, I have a Jew stick in my hat right now, just in case. You know? So they put him on the Jew sus stick, so he stuck, Jesus. Don't ask, this is what really happened. Because he was really the first Jewish comic. I always check how much time I have up here, it's like sex, I'm just happy to be here. So how to get to Vegas? Oh, you don't want to know. I have a minute left. Let's see. In a minute. No pressure. We got to the airport on time. We didn't go through a TSA on time, but it was a three-hour wait. I said, how do I get on the plane? They said, ask people to skip the line. Somebody asked me to skip the line. I talked to my Colombian attorney in love and said, then I key. We then skipped a 300-person line and went right through TSA. We missed the fucking flight anyway. I waited on a line that was so long for food, I just stole the food. She wouldn't eat it. I actually smoked in an electrical closet in Newark Airport. I should be in TSA jail right now. So we get here to Vegas. I miss my ride because my producer got tired of waiting for me. We take a cab to the, I can't tell you the name of the hotel, but it rhymes with tallies. And we get there and I open the door of the hotel and there's three people on a bed eating a pizza. So now I have a little boy fit on the floor. My woman says, act like a man. I said, fine, I'll act like a man. And I got us another room. And that was the good part of the trip. I've never been robbed so much in my life. Here's Vegas. Everything looks beautiful from the outside. I get inside, everything looks basic. It, it, it doesn't make sense. I'm never coming back unless you pay me. I'm out of here. That was good timing. <laughs> that was fantastic timing. Everybody give it up for Twisted Insane. I just want to say thank you.